Hi everybody! Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do an unboxing of something that I picked up from the Chanel 22P Spring Summer Pre-Collection. Here goes! This is the box. Okay. So it comes wrapped very nicely in its really classic um, Chanel packaging with the camellia flower and of course a lot of ribbons here we go this is a true unboxing um, I picked this up about two weeks ago but I haven't had the time to do an unboxing and I thought that hey um, since this is a really highly sought after item from the Chanel 22P collection, why not do an unboxing video and share with as many people as I can? So that's why I'm doing this filming today. Okay. So I noticed that they changed this sticker um, maybe a couple of months back. It used to be this transparent Chanel sticker. So now it feels like a little bit like a paper-ish kind of sticker. It's quite nice. Can you guess what it is? You've got the Chanel dust bag. That's the one in black. The care booklet. Let's go ahead and open this up. to guess what it is by now okay wow okay let me just go ahead and take this paper away from the strap Ta -da! <laughs> so revealing the mini flap with top handle in the lambskin leather. Wow! Can you see how pretty this pink is? It's got to be one of the prettiest pink that Chanel has come out with in recent times. And even though it's in lambskin, I feel like this lambskin um, is a little bit hardier or at least it feels like it's more treated than the regular classic lambskins that I've uh, seen on Chanel bags. So it comes with the top handle and a back pocket. It's uh, It's got the light gold hardware. And I'm just going to go on to open it up. So it's one single compartment with the microchip this microchip over here okay and it doesn't come in any authenticity card anymore since they introduced the microchip and it says here made in Italy and it's got the zipper compartment as well as a little flat compartment where you can put some cards or cash this is so pretty what do you guys think of this Okay, so a little bit of story about this bag. So when I first saw it, when it was launched just at the end of January, um, for the first week of launch, it was just on display and no one could buy it. It's from media. I tried it on, I took some pictures, but this wasn't one of the items that was on my wish list. But when I went home and I was looking through the pictures that I took at the shop, I just started falling in love with the pink. So I told my SA later on, hey, uh, could you just put me on the queue for this one? So two weeks ago, when my SA texted me, she said that she's got one piece for me. I was pleasantly surprised. And of course, I went on to the shop and I had to pick this up immediately. So this one is the exact same size as the mini flap in rectangle. It's just that it's got a top handle 
and this one now here is in lambskin um, and my mini flat that I have in my collection is a, a, a navy blue grained leather they are of the exact same size oh um, interestingly I just noticed that these are a lot thinner than my mini flat chains can you see that my mini flat chains are a lot thicker and chunkier and weightier but the ones on the uh, top handle it's a lot thinner and it's still really pretty and it's really got a good weight i love the chanel chains and i love that it's got this weight on it and it just feels luxurious okay let me just try them on side by side for you to see put this down This is how it looks like. I'm 160 centimeters tall and it sits really nicely at my hip crease. I'll probably wear it like that crossbody most of the time because that's the most convenient. Like you've got your hands free, um, but you can wear it like that too. And I love how you've got this top handle where it's so cute and you know, you can have an additional way of managing the bag. Yeah, I'm just going to do a side-by-side -side comparison of this bag and the mini rectangle flap that I've got. They're exactly the same size. So this is how it looks like. Let me put on my square mini flap to do a quick comparison for you. This is how it looks like side-by-side. -side. The square mini flap sits slightly higher slightly wider okay i'm just gonna very quickly show you what fits in this bag okay so i've got my square mini bag filled at the moment so i'm just gonna put these contents into the new pink bag so i've got my uh a tissue pouch that's gonna go in nicely my chanel card holder over here so this one is gonna Go straight in. I usually have like a foldable, reusable bag. So this one probably I will need to like fold it slightly. And uh, hand sanitizer. So this one goes in. And lastly, got my car keys. So this car keys, I'll just plop it on the top. So this is how it looks. Let me show you. See? So everything fits really really nicely and I believe I would be able to um, squeeze in my iPhone as well. If not, I'll just yeah I'll just place the iPhone in my pocket. So with these items I will be able to close the bag really nicely. There you go. All right, and as you can see, I also have another Chanel item right here, which is yet to be unboxed. I also got this from the Chanel 22P collection. And if you'd like to find out what I got in here, do click on the subscribe button so that I can have you join me in my next unboxing video. I hope that you enjoyed this video today. And if you do, please click on the like button because it would mean a lot to me since this is my first time doing a video like that. And also do let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions about this bag or even if you have any questions about these other two bags that I've got in my collection and I'll try to answer them as much as possible. Okay, see you next time. Bye!